going on you yes you I'm talking to whoever's watching this video YouTube I have once again with me Tara Johnson and Tara has no idea what she's here for even though like two weeks ago was it two weeks ago it was a while ago. I told her, I said, hey, I want to make this video. And I told her what the idea was. And she kind of forgot. So she's hearing for the first time, actually for the second time, but it's going to be like for the first time, what she is on this video for because she don't remember. So we're having a liquidation sale. Well, not really. An imitation, pretend imitation sale. You guys have heard a lot about recently different YouTubers selling their shoe collection for different reasons. So I thought about what if something happened to me, you know, and Tara had to liquidate my shoe collection. How much would she sell certain sneakers for? Especially considering she don't know what they're <laughs> worth. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to just randomly, I got me a little list that I'm going to work for on my phone. I don't want her to see it. But I'm just going to kind of randomly go through and just grab out some sneakers. And I'm not going to tell her what they are or anything. Some of them she's seen before because we've had a couple other videos that we've done. By the way, you want to tell them to check out your other videos? Actually, yeah, you should check them out. And if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and sub subscribe. They are awesome. So just let us know what you think. You can comment at the bottom. Thanks. Thank you. So I'm going to use this list. Now, Terry has some experience with liquida liquidation sales because she's worked for the Family Christian Bookstore and they're going out of business. So she's been working there, helping them to close out the business, and they've been liquidating their whole inventory. So she has some awareness of what a liquidation sale is. But we're going to see if she, how close she get. So, yeah. Yeah, okay. So here we go. I'm just going to randomly grab, and we're going to do 10 sneakers. We're going to do 10. I'm just going to randomly grab some and see how much she was selling for. And she's got a list. Oh, I'm sorry. She's got a list, a piece of paper that she's going to write down uh, how much she would sell that shoe for. And I'll keep them in order. All right. How about this one, Terry? You don't have to move. You're good. How much would you sell these for? Just whatever, you write it on your piece of paper there. And then we're going to go through and we're going to read off her paper what she said. So these red and I guess it's like white, off white or yeah, whatever. Okay. So I'm going to try to keep them in order, too, as we go through. Okay, so she's got that one. Um, let's do these right here. Okay, Terry has to liquidate my inventory because something happened to me. God forbid. But how much would you sell those for, Tara? You see those? And we're going to make the assumption that everything is dead stock, brand new, that I haven't worn anything. We're just going to, for the sake of this exercise, you're going to just pretend like I've never worn anything. Because some of them I have and some of them I haven't. But, okay. yeah. Let's just pretend like I haven't worn anything. So, these right here. Alright, let's see. Uh, oh, you had liked these, so I pulled these out. Remember, you had liked these. This was on your list I did. of shoes that you liked. So, I'm going to pull these out. Right. These were on Tara's list of shoes that she uh, liked. I got two pair of these, so she's going to sell two pair for, I don't know, whatever amount. So, she's got those down. Um, <laughs> I know, I'm going to get one that I, I know she didn't like. Y'all right, like excuse me for having to move around here a little bit. Um, yeah, you didn't like these, so I'm going to pull these out. <laughs> They're probably going to buy them for yeah. real with me. <laughs> she didn't like these, so I'm going to oh, pull these Lord. out. How, how much would you sell these for? Like. <laughs> <laughs> you got it? Yes. Okay. Uh-oh, sorry. Uh, just, uh. Putting my list back up. Okay. So, 
Tara's written down how much she would sell these for. So, it's three. Uh, hmm. Let me check my list. See what else I got on my list that I can pull out. Oh, I got some. Hold on, I'll be right back. Here you go. Let's do these. I actually like those. When I walked in the room, I was like, man, those are awesome. So, hey. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> All right. So, how much would you sell these for? All right. Okay. All right. Uh... Let's do these. Alright. There. So See how much she would sell these like for. These. Yeah. yeah. What's those, Terry? Ta da! Ah, the symbols. The symbol? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Did she say the symbol? <laughs> the symbol! <laughs> All right, let me see. Okay, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, four more. Okay. Uh, here we go. Let's do these. Okay. How much would you sell those for? We're gonna go through her list and see how what, what how much she said for each of these sneakers that we pulled out. Liquidation sale. So, all right. Uh, hmm. Oh, let's do these. How much would you sell those for? Whoa! What in the world? <laughs> Yeah, um, it's going to be with a little bit of prejudice because I, like, just first seeing these shoes and I do not like them. So. Okay. <laughs> so if she don't like them, you're probably going to get them for cheap. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> Tara's selling my shoe collection. All right, liquidation sale. Okay. So, uh, two more, right? Yes. Let's see here. Um. Uh, Wow, I want to make this. Okay, here we go. This was on your top five list. So let's see, how much would you sell these for? Let's see what Tara would sell these for here. All right, last pair. Okay, and the last pair. Uh, let's do the ones right next to them. I could have did the blue ones down there, but let's do these. Let's do these right here. All right, there we go. How would what you sell those for, Tara? <laughs> All right. All righty. Okay, so everybody knows what we're doing here, right? We're pretending, <laughs> pretending <laughs> that we're having a liquidation sale, and Tara, something happened to me, and Tara is responsible for. Selling his shoes. <laughs> yeah. So we picked out 10 of them. And she's written down how much she was selling for. So here we go. All right. The first ones were <laughs> the 1991, right? 91 alternate. Some people call them the alternate hairs. But these are the alternate sixes. 1991 alternate hairs. Alternate sixes. So Tara... Tell all of our wonderful YouTube <laughs> listeners, subscribers, and followers how much you're going to sell these for. Oh, man. Okay. So, I put down $85. $85. <laughs> okay. $85. <laughs> Y'all want me to tell her now or go through it and tell her how much? Yeah. Go through it because I'm about to be surprised myself. Okay. <laughs> so we're going to go through them, see what Tara said, and I'm going to tell her. Yeah, all right. <laughs> what you sell these for? I sold those for $70. She sold these for $70. Okay. <laughs> Is anybody on the floor laughing yet? <laughs> <laughs> Probably. <laughs> <laughs> what you sell those for? 
120. 120, folks. 120. Now, mind you, I still have, uh, we're pretending like everything is brand new, never been worn, and I still have these dead stock. I have another pair of these because I doubled up dead stock. So, 120. All right, Tara's favorite shoe. All right, <laughs> these came with prejudice, you know, the price, so $45. $45, as Eddie Murphy would say, what a bargain. <laughs> $45. All righty, yep. All righty. What you sell these for, Tara? I like these shoes. I actually put a price tag wow. of $250. $250. <laughs> 250 folks. You can get these for two fifty. What you sell these for? I sold those for a hundred and fifteen dollars. One fifteen. Those are nice. <laughs> these? Those I put a price range, so anywhere from two fifty to three hundred dollars. Oh, you must like these. I do. You do really? Wow. Even though they're white, of most a lot of white in them? Yeah. You know this oh, upper is reflective. It's three M. Yeah, something about them I like. <laughs> okay. Oh, another favorite shoe. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this price came with free. <laughs> <laughs> right. This price came with prejudice as well, so price range of forty five to fifty dollars. Forty five to fifty dollars. Uh yeah, let's do these. Okay. I did like these, so those I put at three twenty five. Three twenty five. Three twenty five. And finally, what you sell those for? Those I put at 120. 120. She sold these for 120. Alrighty, well, let me grab my phone. <laughs> and before I grab my phone, let me just tell you that um I what I did was, like I said, we're pretending like everything's brand new. I went and checked a couple of sources. I used as my reference on the prices, I use uh, Fine Line 1721 because people are familiar with Fine Line 1721 because some of the, the pretty big YouTubers uh, have used Fine Line 1721. I also have used Flight Club because Flight Club, I'm going to use that as a standard for some of the prices. I've also used Amazon when I didn't have a reference point from Flight Club or Fine Line 21. If they didn't have that particular shoe, I used Amazon. And I also used, it was, let me see, Fine Line 1721, Flight Club, Amazon, and I used one more, and I can't remember who I used, but it was some, another uh, reference uh, as far as what the pricing was. So, Tara, you have sold the alternate <laughs> sixes, the hairs, 1981, for $85, and if you check and and went online to one of those reference sources that I just named uh, these would actually sell for $225 oh my goodness <laughs> <Whoa>. <laughs> okay yep $225 so uh, somebody just got a, a steal definitely <laughs> now these Terra have sold for $70 these are the Laney 14's yep Laney 14's for $70. Now, I know some people are on the floor right now. Because the Laney 14s will sell for $250. Dang. Oh, my goodness. $250, and Tara just sold them for $70. <laughs> like a Goodwill shop. <laughs> yes. All right. The Royal Ones. Tara sold them for... $120. $120. Royal Ones would be selling for... Uh, I checked, and I think I got this price off of Flight Club, I believe, three hundred dollars. I mean, we know the prices on these vary depending on where you're going and what sources, but I just use one of those, like I said, for my point of reference. So three hundred dollars, and she sold them for one twenty. Okay. All right, her favorite shoe. How much you sell them for? Forty-five dollars. Forty-five dollars. How far you off? You think you were? Uh, man, I think I'm pretty accurate because the shoes is <laughs> ugly. <laughs> All right, the Penny Twos in this colorway, in this colorway, the Penny Twos, two hundred dollars. <laughs> Dang! 
Woo! Okay. Yep, the Penny Twos in this colorway. Two hundred dollars. All right. She just sold them for forty-five. <laughs> Somebody is really happy right now. Right? Sorry, pity. <laughs> <laughs> now she she said the maroon sixes. She went two fifty on the maroon sixes. These are the maroon I sixes. Like those. See the Nike Air on the back? Yes. Nike Air on the back. Maroon sixes would be selling for three hundred dollars. Uh -huh. so She got close though. For two fifty. She sold them for two fifty. <laughs> so three hundred dollars. Maroon sixes. These are man, if anybody get these in as soon as they get them, they're gone. Yeah, those, yeah, those look good. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> All Star Ones. Oh my goodness. Okay, I sold them for $115. Two fifty. Oh my goodness. All Star Ones, two fifty. Gracious. Chinese New Year twelves. I uh this was a between price, so this was two fifty to three hundred dollars. She got pretty close, three twenty five. Three twenty five. <laughs> she got pretty close, three twenty five. Mm -hmm. Chinese New Year. Mm -hmm. Twelves. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I don't even know what I know if I want to tell her who shoe this is again. Cause yeah. every time you should know though. Oh my god! Are those pennies again? Nope. Okay. Um. Anyway, before he tells me, I sold these between forty-five and fifty dollars. Between forty-five and fifty dollars. These are the. <laughs> These are the Allen Iversons. So oh my god, you didn't show me the cute one the back. I didn't show her the back. The <laughs> Allen Iverson question me is these are the practice. Allen Iverson practice. Whew. You ready for this? Okay, go ahead. Amazon 140. Seriously? Yeah. Amazon 140 in the same size. New. Sorry, Al Allen Iverson. I, I, I do like the way you play when you played and all of that, but your shoes I cannot get with. So man, forgive girl, me. You <laughs> tripping, man. The, question, the questions are dope. <laughs> Flu games. I actually sold those for three twenty five. And guess what? She was dead on three twenty five. Really? Oh, man. Flight Club. At least one of them. <laughs> yep. Flight Club just brought the price down. Regretfully so. <laughs> right. Yeah. But three twenty five is his most recent price. Size ten. Dead stock. Flu game twelves. <laughs> Air Jordan. And finally, <laughs> you know what these are? No. You sure? Oh, Patent leather. Jordan. Okay. Jordan, yeah. Okay, like. These are the Space Jam 11s. <laughs> Space Jam, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, okay. and you sold them for. Here you go, folks. She sold the Space Jam 11s for. $120. $120. And, <laughs> yeah. and Plato's Closet just sold a pair of these worn for $200. Oh, my goodness. So, <laughs> the actual. Price, uh, I want to say, <laughs> I can't find them on my list now. Of uh, Space Jam 11s, three fifty. Oh my goodness! Sorry, Jordan. Three fifty. She sold them for one twenty, and Plato's Closet even sold them for more than that. Oh my goodness. <laughs> well, Terry, what do you have to say? Well, I'm sure your buyers would be happy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Well, I'm not really selling my shoe collection, no. Especially now that I have her to depend on <laughs> to do this for me. So, if anybody still wants a job working security for Terror, you know, uh, hit me up. Leave some comments down there that you want the job and how much would you be wanting to get paid to do it. <laughs> Mind you that you're risking your life. <laughs> so, this is the piano guy. You have anything else you want to say before we go? Sign up? No, I'm... I'm at a loss of words. Wow. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> I lost my words. Yeah. Because I'm salty. <laughs> <laughs> Which ones were you felt the worst about? Like the first one. Yeah. And the Space Jams. <laughs> 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 like, dang. <laughs> <laughs> you don't feel bad about how far off you were on the penny, too? No. I mean, you were pretty far off on no. those. No. I told them that they was going to come with prejudice, so no. But that's the penny, too, though. And the Laney 14s, Tara? Seventy dollars for the lady fourteens. Seventy dollars. Yeah. <laughs> uh, hey, Tara already told you. you Want to tell him again? Subscribe. 
yeah subscribe like leave comments let us know what you think um uh, if you want more videos at least where i'm in them definitely let us know but uh oh, yeah he's pretty creative i you know kind of like what he comes up with so <laughs> I like it. this is the piano guy and tara johnson till next time Peace. Mm -hmm.